Hi there, this is just going to be a quick tutorial on how to use this website. So when you get here, you're first going to click on systems. And this website um, has kind of three parts to it. Um, you have to input, this is a system and you can change the parts of your system. Um, here is the energy input and there are four choices. You can have somebody ride a bicycle and you can have her pedal slow or even faster and that inputs energy into the system. You could also turn on a faucet and to turn on the faucet you just open the the lever and the water comes out. You could change to a sun and you can change the amount of cloud cover and that inputs energy into the system or you could use a tea kettle and you can turn up the heat and that releases steam and that um, again those are the four ways to you're adding energy into this system once energy is added to the system you then need to change it to electricity and there are two ways to change electricity to uh, change energy to electricity you could use a generator which is the spinning wheel right here or you could use a solar panel so once you have electricity, then, electri uh, then energy will then be able to flow out of the system. And there are four ways to and have energy flow out. You could use a uh, burner on a stove and boil a pan of water. You could have a light bulb, and this is an old fashioned incandescent light bulb. You could have a CFL light bulb. These are the newer types of light bulbs. Or you could have a fan. Now, when you use this uh, website, uh, another important thing to do is to turn on your energy symbols. So here are the forms of energy that will flow through this system. You could have mechanical energy. That would be that light gray color. Blue is electrical energy. This reddish orange color is thermal or heat. The yellow E represents light or radiant energy. And then finally, the green represents chemical energy. And when you turn that little checkbox on and you set up a system such as this, you can see how energy flows into the system. And you can also see the types of energy that flow into the system and how that energy changes as it goes through the system. So here we have a bicyclist. Oh, we need to give her more energy. Uh, so, and then you can see how the chemical energy flows through her to the bicycle and that green energy changes into different forms of energy. Uh, it then um, um, changes into, converts into electrical energy. And then it flows in through the fan and comes out as mechanical energy. So that's how this system, how this, how this website works. And again, you can uh, change out different things to see. Um, um, how energy, how different forms of energy flow into a system, how you are able to convert them to other forms of energy, and then how they flow out of a system. So answer the rest of that worksheet and get that finished and then move on to the next part of the module.